This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com Okay, Rabbi Yisai, we're continuing to Rodaf Hashor, we're up to Simen Pei Vav. Shetzarch Laharchik Min Mayim Sruchim You have to distance yourself from putrid water. It says, Mechaber Mayim Sruchim Oimei Mishra Smelly water, or water that you soaked something in, namely, Shesharn Bahen Pishon, you soaked linen, flax, or canvas, or canvas, so you have to distance yourself as if it would be tsaya. So this smelly water, or water that you soaked linen or canvas, you have to distance yourself from it like it would be tsaya. Says Meshabura Mayim Sruchim, Alkain, therefore, Oisan Mikvais, those Mikvais, Shemei Mehen Sruchin, those Mikvais that their waters are putrid, Bimais Hakayitz, Lemi Baida Asal Vach Besoychan, it goes without saying you don't, you're not to make a brach on them, Afilo Harchacha Kitsaya Bainan. You even have to distance yourself like it would be Tsaya. Vedavke Masriach Ad Shadarch Bene Adam Let Star Me Oisa Rechra. Davka, if it's smelly, to the point where it's the Darach of people, to be bitsar from that bad smell. The Dershu says even somebody who's accustomed to the smell, it's still going to be an issue. Gino Shimam Shichim La Maim Suchim Viram, the Smuchal Basic Nessus, a garden that they draw to it smelly water, and it's near a Basic Nessus, Af Im Kadma. Even if the garden came first, Balagino Tsarchla Hachik, the Balagina has the distance, to have a Milsa de Isura. Because this is a matter of Isser. So it seemed like a fertilizer that smells, and it could be painfully smelly, is a problem. Yeah? Something that smells, it doesn't really matter exactly wh- why it's smelling. Oimei Mishra, Shemasriach v'choshkein Mishra shal koivs, and certainly the soaked water of launderer, Shemachavzam bigdei ketanem sheish v'am tsoya, then one would have to distance from it. Kemoi, just like from Tsaya, right? So, Laimar, the fun of Kemoi Enav, before you, as far as you could see, Ula Achrav, and behind you, Dalar Amois, four Amois, Mimakim Shakala Reach, from where the smell stops. Vukasa Primagadam, the Surai Hu Minatoira. Primagadam writes, it's Isser is Midai Raisa, Kemoi Tsaya. Kasav Ha'ol Yaraba, Vuhuva Be Primagadam. The Elia Rabbah writes, and it's born of the Prima Gadim, Bimartafais Hayayin, Shiyesh Reach Ram Upash, the Kotzbe, wine cellars that have a bad smell that smells like it's decomposing, and one is disgusted by it, also Likurus Krishma, it's also to say Shema, Vadin Kolka Hagavna, or any similar Dvarim Shebekdusha, Varambam Perkdam, Hilchasfil, Lachates, Mashma, the Mutter from the Rambam, it's mashma that it is mutter. For Akedah Chachama in his Rambam's Abayis Hatfil, only the great sages were careful at the time of davening. Ayin Sham Ulapela Shalai He Irubaza. So the El Yarabba writes and brought the Prima Gadim that there is an issue with these wine cell, uh, cellars, but from the Rambam it's mashma that it's not a problem and it's a pella that the Achroinim did not. Uh, notice this Ramam. What about to say uh, Krishma opposite Sinor Biov? I guess it's a sewer pipe. Rav Shomazam says it's mutter because it doesn't store tsaya, it's only a transport. It doesn't matter what material it's made out of. Rabbi Yashav also says there's no issue. As long as it doesn't smell. But the Chazoinish is reported to have made a distinction between uh, different types of situations. That if it's made out of metal, you could make a bracha. If it's made out of cheras, you can't. Other poskim say that a sewer pipe is a problem. Rabbi Sion Abishol says that a sewer pipe is a problem. Simon pays ayin. Kamatzarch laharchik b'shas kriyshma menagraf shel rei. How far do you need to distance yourself at the time of kriyshma from a graf shel rei? 
Graf Shore is basically a mound of excrement. So Graf Shore Avid Shomeira Glaim, were a bucket of urine, Shalcheras, out of earthenware, Oishal Eitz, Tarach Lahachik Mehem. You have to distance from it, Kamay Mitsoya, like from Tsoya, Filu Heto Behemaim, even if you put water in it. Avalam Hain Shamadchis. If they are made out of metal, Oishal Zuchuchis, or a glass, Oishal Cheras Matsupa, or glazed earthenware, Mutter. It's permitted in Hem Rechutzim Yafe if they are washed well. Says the Mishabura, Garaf, Va'afilu im ata ein bahem klum. Even if right now there's nothing in them. Va'afilu im Hem Rechutzim Yafe mi bifnim. Even if they're cleaned well from the inside, umi bachutz, and from the outside, unakim legamri, they're spick and span. They're spackling clean. Shein bahem afilu reach ra. If the material that they're made out of is cheres or eitz, even if they're spackling clean, you have to distance yourself to Al-Ramis, like from Tsoya itself. If the kli is used for something else, you wear it as a hat, and it's also an Avit Shomer Aglayim. Let's say you pour some dirty water in it from washing kalim. If there's no tzav loy reach ra mutter, so if it has another use, it's mutter. V'cheinim b'chol pam shemashten, or if every time you urinate, noisin l'soicher avias ram, you put in it a avias of water mutter, it's permitted. Im ein magia mimenu reach ra if there's no bad smell. V'nirali, the baza in this situation magia reach ra min akli, if a reach ra emanates from the kli, dinoi ka avit mamish, it's like mamish en avit. You have to distance for Amas from where the smell stops. So if it has another use, then you don't have to distance yourself from it if it's clean and it doesn't smell. But if it does smell, then it for sure has a din of Avid Shomei Raglayim. Okay, and we will hold it over here. Okay, see everybody tomorrow at uh, same time, 9 a.m. Call Tov. Call Tov, everybody. Have a good day. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.